Hello, I'm Kevin Davis, the editor of BioIT World, and with me is Joe Corkery, Vice President of Business Development for OpenEye, celebrating their best of show victory in uh, a very intense competition at uh, BioIT World uh, yesterday. Joe, welcome, congratulations. Oh, thank you very much. Thought we'd just spend a couple of minutes and you can tell us about the, uh, the product that you want for, Brood. What is, what is Brood? So Brood is uh, an application that we've developed that does uh, fragment replacement and uh, molecular design. Uh, it's a lead optimization product where you'll take a, uh, a query molecule that you have, uh, you want to do something new with. So either there's um, you know, a fragment inside the molecule that you'd like to replace for a variety of reasons, whether it's, uh, you know, it's got a toxic property, uh, whether the whole molecule is covered by somebody else's patent, or you just want to explore other property space or optimize the whole molecular properties of the, uh, of the query itself. So what you do is you take the molecule, you d select that fragment that you'd like to replace, and then Brood searches through uh, an extraordinarily large database of millions of fragments that have been uh, pulled together from uh, different collections and uh, matches those fragments using uh, shape, chemistry, and uh, electrostatics and uh, does that overlay for you and then filters on a wide variety of uh, customizable molecular properties. So what do you think the uh, best, uh, best of show judges saw that uh, appealed to them? I think the, uh, it's, a, it's a very interesting problem, uh, the ability to uh, explore uh, different spaces, um, to get out of the area you're in and sort of a way to do a lead hop, which I think was very interesting to them, as well as the, uh, the wide variety of properties that we calculate um, at the end, uh, in addition to uh, you know, uh, some probabilities of activity based on uh, some belief work that was done at Abbott and um, you know, some, uh, some synthetic accessibility scores as well uh, as ways to filter your results at the end. How new is the product? Uh, the product is, it was released this month, so it's um, very new. Oh, actually, the, uh, the product we is, has been around for about uh, two, three years. This is a major new release that we're doing this month. Okay, I'm sure that had something to do with it as well. So is this primarily for Big Pharma, or who's, who's, who's the ideal uh, user of Brood? Yeah, so our target audience has uh, been sort of the uh, molecular modeler groups in Big Pharma, although uh, there are a lot of biotech and uh, smaller companies that use it as well. And how's business? Is it sort of stable? I mean, there's a lot of consolidation going on in the pharma industry, and uh, we know that uh, for you know many economic reasons, Farmageddon, people call it. H how are things uh, at OpenEye? Uh, things are actually going really well. It's uh, uh, been a good year for us, and we're looking forward to having, we have this um, coming out right now, and we have a couple other things in the pipeline coming out later this year, so we're hoping that it should continue to be a pretty good year for OpenEye. Well, you impressed our BioIT World judges, uh, and they're no slouches. So congratulations again. Well done. Enjoy the rest of the show. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure being here. Mark your calendar. BioIT World Expo 2011 takes place April 12th through the 14th in Boston. We hope to see you next year. For more information, visit bio-itworldexpo.com.